Aloha mai kako. This short video is for you to learn the kiipa and for the kane to learn their language of the kiipa. And we're going to be looking at the feet today for what a kiipa is as well as the hands. So the kiipa is sort of the intermission in between verses where with our body we say May I hula for you and may I hula for you. Okay, that's what a wahine's kiipa is going to look like. But the gentleman's kiipa is going to be a strong stance with your elbow and your arm parallel to the ground. And you're going to say, may I hula for you, looking over your right elbow. And kane, may I hula for you, looking over your left elbow. Okay, so when we keep ha, it's going to be opposite hands. Because the ladies will come forward with their right hand. And then the left hand. But the kanes are going to come in with a strong fist looking to the right and a strong fist looking to the left. Okay, that's the hand motions for the key pot. Now I'm going to adjust my camera so hopefully you guys can see my feet. Um, and I will teach you the foot movement for a kiipa, which is a kaholo. It is a three steps with a four count timing. Okay, so just watch my feet. One, two, three, and one, two, three, and. You see how my hips shifted on the end? That's what you're going to do. Okay? One, two, three, and one, two, three, and. The other thing I want you to be mindful of is that I don't want you straight knees. You're going to have a little bit of a bend, okay? Because if you have a little bit of a bend, your hips are going to naturally sway and you don't need to push it, okay? Look at yourself in the mirror. Don't push your hips. You're going to allow it to naturally sway. One, two, three, and stepping left two, three, and. The and is very important because you have to have your weight in the proper center of gravity. Okay? So now, ladies, even though you're going to be watching my feet, I want your hands, your right hand on your waist, and your right hand is going to come up in front. Remember this move? Okay, and then you're going to go like this. One, two, three, and. One, two, three, and. Okay, one, two, three, and. One, two, three, and. Now let's do the feet, but add your hands. One, two, three, and. One, two, three, and. And for the kane, let's see your fists. Right hand first. One, two, three, and. One, two, three. All right, let's 
let's see if you can watch my body do the whole thing. You probably won't be able to see my feet in this camera, but we'll try to piece it together, okay? So, this is your key pa. One, two, three, and one, two, three, and. Gentlemen, one, two, three, and. One, two, three, and. Just want you guys to see my back, how nice and straight it is. I'm not doing this, okay? And I'm not doing this either. But my back is nice and straight. So gentlemen, make sure your back is nice and straight when you're coming around to do your key pa. Okay? One, two, three, and. One, two, three. And ladies, one, two, three, and one, two, three, and. And then we're gonna weave that in between every verse. All right? That's your ki'i pa. Say that with me. Ki'i pa. May I hula for you and for you. Thanks, sweetheart.